When are we going to get back? Yes, yeah, when are we going to get back? And when you're yeah, going to yeah, get yeah. back to Earth. All the whys and the wherefores. Now, look, just give us a minute or two to get our breath back, and then we'll have a nice, relaxed session. We'll answer all your questions, everything you want to know. OK, everybody, oh. thank you very much. <laughs> What is that? Come on, I'll introduce you. Maya, this is my brother, Guido. <laughs> I'm his elder brother, and his smarter brother, and his handsome brother. In every other way, he's a poor second. Put it there, old buddy. Certainly, old buddy. Is it always like this between you? No, no, I usually dominate him effortlessly. Oh, he has to have his little fantasies. It comes from the fact that I always stole his girls. That's because he can never get any of his own. <laughs> oh, come on, I'll introduce you. Helena, this is Peter Rockwell. Hello, how are you? He's a pilot. We were going to get married when my tour of duty on Alpha ended. I've heard a lot about you. I thought I'd lost it for good. Never underestimate the extent of human inventiveness. You always did take that view. You knew each other before? Dr. Shaw was my tutor at medical college. He taught me everything there is to know about being a doctor. Um, what do you do, Guido? He's a cab driver. I captain the Super Swift that brought us here. It's a miracle anybody made it. <laughs> um, how did you attain a speed faster than night? Um, a little old Earth has progressed, you see. Um, physics came up with a new wrinkle. We can now make loops in the continuum. No, don't let him fool you, Maya. He hasn't got the faintest idea what he's talking about. Yeah, it was Reinhardt who made the breakthrough at Cambridge. Cambridge, England. Massachusetts. It means we can travel anywhere in the universe now. The journey back to Earth well, is just a bus ride in Earth time. We're just the scouting party. The big transporters will be along soon, and then it's goodbye moon for everyone. Oh, I can't wait. Maya? She'll be all right. How's it, Mama? You know, Mama, she's making you a mound of pasta the size of Vesuvius. <laughs> and the sauce. I know, I know. Everything in it but holy water. How did she take it? When the news broke that we'd blown out? Three days of weeping, and then two weeks of phoning the White House to demand action. <laughs> oh, boy, that's Mama. And then she finally decided simply not to believe it. The scientists were talking out of their navel as usual. It was simply a matter of time. And Papa. He went quiet. And he got thin. Yeah. 